Hi everyone, welcome back to another video. So today in this video, I have a coloring book flip through and review. This is a grayscale coloring book. It's called The Elf of Paladin, it's by Rachel Mintz. And normally I don't do flip throughs of individual coloring books unless there's something extra special about the coloring book. And I thought this coloring book deserved its own video. So I really wanted to share it with y'all today. In the description box, I will have a link where you can purchase this coloring book as well as the PDF copy of it. And after I get through the flip through of this coloring book, I'm going to show you what the images in here look like on tone tan paper. And when you see that, <laughs> you're probably going to want to run to the Rachel Mintz website and pick up a copy of this coloring book for yourself. But let's go ahead and get into this flip through. Okay, so here on the very first page, it just says the Elf of Paladin, grayscale coloring book for adults, stunning surreal elves, women, warriors, and goblins, beautiful intricate portraits, 35 times two, darker and lighter. In this coloring book, you are going to get a darker version of the image and a lighter grayscale version of the image. If you scan this, it will take you to the Rachel Mintz website and there you will find the PDF versions of all of their coloring books for those of you that want to print on your own paper. So we do get a color testing page. You can test out your color combinations in these little circles here. So here is the first image and this is why I wanted to share this coloring book because look at these images. They are just absolutely beautiful. So like I said earlier, you get a darker version of grayscale and then you get a lighter version of grayscale. And the main reason that I wanted to share this coloring book and do a flip through for just this book is because I think that this book would be fabulous for beginners. And I know I have a lot of new subscribers that have just joined my channel and are just finding this hobby. So I really wanted to share this grayscale coloring book because a lot of people are intimidated by grayscale but grayscale really teaches you how to color because you've got three different levels of grayscale. You've got darker grayscale, medium grayscale, and a lighter grayscale. It guides you and allows you to know where to put your darkest colors, your midtones, your lightest colors, or the colors you want to use for your highlights. But these images are just so beautiful. It's a realistic, fantasy type of artwork and they look like actual real portraits like it was a picture that was taken and just placed on the page when you color these and bring them to life they are just really going to look absolutely amazing now this is the amazon version of the book the pages are one-sided so if you wanted to use markers on these pages you could do so. You would just need to take a piece of paper and stick it behind the pages. Now, like I said, you can purchase the PDF version of this book and I will always have a discount code down below in the description box where you can save 33% on any one of the coloring books that you want to purchase from Rachel Mintz. And having the PDF version is really, really nice because you can print it on any paper you want. Now, after I finish going through the flip through so you can look at these gorgeous images, I mean, look at how beautiful they are. But Grayscale is just really great for beginners and it's a really nice guide to help you know where to lay your colors onto the page. But look how beautiful these portraits are. And since these are elves, you can color the hair any color you want. You can get so creative with the hair colors and the mixing of your colored pencils. And I love how there is a darker image and then there's a lighter image. I actually have the PDF version as well. Once I saw the PDF version and the way the images looked on my computer screen and after I printed an image out on my tone tan paper, I had to share this coloring book. But after I finish the flip through and show you all the images in this book, I am going to show you the image that I printed on the tone tan paper. But I just can't get over how realistic these images look. And Rachel Mintz does have some other books with very realistic images like this. But this one I just thought was absolutely beautiful. And I love the lighter version of the grayscale. If you're more of a beginner, I would probably use the darker version of the grayscale. But if you've been coloring for a little while and you pretty much know where to lay your colors, I would probably use the lighter version of the grayscale. But I just think all of these elves in this book are just so beautiful. And you can really focus on creating gold or tones of gold 
in this book or bronze or silver because we've got all this intricate detail in the crowns. Now in this book you are going to have some images like this and I wouldn't color this because <laughs> that's just not my style. But most of the book is going to be images like this of just beautiful women. And then there are a couple men as you saw earlier. But it just amazes me how they can get them to look so realistic looking. So again you've got your darker image and then you have have your lighter image and if you wanted to do backgrounds on here you could now some of the images do have a black background if I'm remembering correctly from the beginning of the book and then some of them have the white background so for the ones that have the lighter background you can do some kind of background there and the ones that have a darker background it will just make your colored pencil work really pop that much more okay so here is one that has the black background for instance if you were to color this one I would probably give her something like blonde hair or a really bright colored hair to really make it pop out up against the black background. And then you have your lighter version of it. But if I was coloring this one, I would probably do the darker version. That way the black actually looks black. And then here we have more men. So you're going to have some men trinkled throughout the coloring book. But for the most part, most of them are women. And then it just says, thank you for coloring with us. We hope you had a wonderful time. And then here it's just going to show us some of the other coloring books by Rachel Mintz. We have The Cutest Houses. I think I have a flip through on my channel of that one somewhere. You can use my link below and go to their website and purchase the PDF versions of the books. And you will actually save quite a bit of money by doing it that way. And it will allow you to print it on any paper you want to, the Spring Hill paper, the Tone Tan paper. And I'm gonna show you an image printed on the Tone Tan paper, but it just tells you here a lot of the other books that are available. Thank you for coloring with us. They're asking you to please review the book. Now, when you all purchase coloring books and you purchase them on Amazon, it is always nice to leave a review for the company or the artist because your review may be the one that makes somebody decide that they want to purchase the coloring book. Here is the back of the book and then of course it just shows some of the images that are inside the book, the darker version and then the lighter version. Now I want to show you this image that I actually printed out on the tone tan paper and look how beautiful this looks on the tone tan paper. Now I've told you all a million times. <laughs> Grayscale looks amazing on tone tan paper. And once you add color to the image, it just really makes it pop. And these images are going to look so realistic. This is something that you could probably actually put into a frame and put up on your wall when you complete it because it will just look so real like an actual photograph when it's done. Here's the tone tan paper that I use. I use the nine by 12, it comes with 50 sheets. And so since it is nine by 12, you do need a paper cutter to cut it down to eight and a half by 11, but it's very, very easy to do. All of the pages are perforated and they are very easy to take right out of here. But I will have a link for the paper as well down in the description box because this is available on Amazon. If you don't want to purchase it on Amazon, you could get it at a Hobby Lobby, at a Michaels. And sometimes Michaels does run sales. Buy one, get one 50% off. And that's probably the best time to be able to purchase this paper. When they have those sales, I end up buying some of the colored pencil paper by Strathmore, the tone tan paper, the tone gray, and I really just stock up. I stocked up the last time they had a sale on these because I use this paper all the time. It is one of my absolute favorites, especially when I'm coloring something that is grayscale. So I'm sure you can see why I wanted to do an individual flip through on this coloring book. It's just absolutely beautiful. It has so many realistic fantasy images in it. And when I pulled the PDF version of it up on my computer screen, I was just blown away by the portraits and how beautiful they were. And then when I grabbed my tone tan paper and I printed one of them out, I was just like, wow. <laughs> It's just so beautiful. But there's just so many beautiful images in this coloring book. So the link to the website will be down in the description box below, as well as my coupon code so that you can get 33% off. Now this book is only $5 on the website. So once you apply my coupon code of 33% off, you are getting this coloring book for a fantastic deal. I hope you all have a wonderful day and I will see you in the next video. Happy coloring. Bye.